Good morning. Today is the day we are leaving Aspen. So you guys are getting the tail end of the trip. But listen, I've been kind of brainstorming and I'm realizing this is probably the best time to vlog because now I know the lay of the land. Now if you just threw me on the streets, I would know exactly where to go. We've got our local ice cream spot. We've got our local panini spot. We know where to get coffee. We know where the ice skating rink is. I don't think we're gonna be able to smash all that in in the span of two hours, but we're gonna try and show you as much as we can. And by we, I mean Christina. <laughs> what are your thoughts of Aspen so far? Cold, mm -hmm. beautiful, lively. I don't know, Aspen's cool. Is it really 11 degrees? Oh my God, wait. It was nine when we woke up. Oh my God. Christina just proposed that I do a get ready with me in Korean. My Korean is very rudimentary. 안녕하세요, 여러분. 지금 세수 할 거예요. Is that yeah? 지금 세수 time. 이 세수 비누? Cleanser. Cleanser. 너무 좋아. 대박. 우유처럼 느낌이야. 부드럽고. We're off to a rough start, folks. Yeah. Breakfast is served. Okay, mukbang. Mukbang. <gasps> For breakfast, we definitely got like a princess situation. We've got an omelet with spinach, tomato, a mountain of mixed berries, and some toast. Like, what a way to end our trip. I know. Right? What's been your favorite part of the trip so far? I really enjoyed our nature walk. <gasps> There's like this uh, sanctuary called like John Denver Sanctuary. Omelet is delicious. Dude, the food in Aspen has been popping. The food. Mm -hmm. We have not had a single bad meal here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I started my period. I'm actually really proud of myself because this time I packed a little period pouch with all my feminine hygiene needs. We've got tampons, overnight pads, panty liners, normal pads, Tylenol PM. It's just nice to have everything prepared. We are out and about right now, enjoying the gorgeous scenes of Aspen. <sighs> <sighs> and the sun is out. This is the park where we took one of our shots and it looks like there was it looked like it was snowing in the background, but in reality it was this snow machine. The snow was a paid actor. <laughs> we are on our way to go to Paradise Cafe to get some ice cream. We gotta get like one last bite before we left. Uh, can we get a little scoop of the uh, strawberry gelato? Yeah, in a cup or in a waffle? Uh, in a cup, please. Me? <laughs> the cookie is the best part. Come on. At nine in the morning? Yeah. I just booked a therapy appointment. It feels really good to be back at home, settling down and grounding myself with my routine again. And therapy is an act of self-care that really helps me process my thoughts and organize the things that I'm feeling. So on the topic of therapy, I wanna do a huge thank you to BetterHelp for sponsoring this video. I like to think of my therapist as like a human interactive journal because she acts as such a wonderful container for me to dump everything out, process, and make sense of everything that's going on in my life. And BetterHelp makes it super easy and less intimidating to start. You just go to my link, betterhelp.com slash Jen. You can start off with a video call, phone call, or even messaging. It all depends on what you feel comfortable doing. And getting started is super easy and breezy. You just fill out a questionnaire where you highlight what areas you'd like to focus on, the type of therapist you'd like, and then BetterHelp will use that information to match you with someone that they think is most compatible. And in most cases, Cases, they will match you with someone within 48 hours and from there you can schedule your own session of course if you're not completely gelling with your therapist they make it really easy and simple to switch at no additional cost join over 4 million people who have used BetterHelp to live a more connected more introspective life you can go to my link betterhelp.com slash Jen that's better h-e-l-p for 10% off your first month I'll also leave that link in the description box definitely click it so you can connect with a therapist and see if that helps
helps you. Okay, so I took off the turtleneck because I wanted to show you the outfit that I'm wearing tonight. We've got quite a few things on the agenda. First, we're gonna head on over to LACMA. They have like this cool Korean exhibition. And then later, we're gonna go to the Soho Warehouse for the Mistress Mahjong Year of the Tiger event. It's gonna have a lot of bomb food because Family Style is curating all the vendors. So we're gonna be looking at art and eating delicious food. What more could you ask for? I just ordered a bibimbap to eat by myself. This is a complete feast. My skin, so incredibly soft. Not gonna lie, it was like 25 minutes of, of pain. I couldn't really describe the, the scrub as a relaxing experience per se, but I'm glad I did it. Either way, I feel like the first layer of my skin is gone. <laughs> this is like one of my favorite self-care activities. Yep. Okay. I'm definitely spoiling my appetite for dinner. I'm cooking jjimtak. And let's try the broth. Damn. That's good. These chips are pretty spectacular. I like this brand a lot. E1. I don't know why I, I like pretend that it's like a Korean brand. It's probably pronounced Iwan. They have these really good protein sticks. So far I've tried the barbecue flavor, which is delicious, but sweet Dijon, mm, mm -hmm. it's got that texture that healthy chips tend to have that feel a little bit more substantial. It's like sorghum material. It's just more dense, a little bit more cardboard like, but in a good way. I don't know, these are good. friends today we are doing something about these roots in my head i think there's like a centimeter of roots we are going to change that <laughs> 
right now. We're gonna go see Anna. This is like the first time you guys are gonna see her new studio. I love the way she decorated her space. It's truly like an extension of her home. It's really funky, vibrant colors. Think like there's like Keith Haring art, Andy Warhol pop art. Also the snacks. Let's see if she has the freaking Chex Mix. It's literally always like a maze here. Okay, no, I took a wrong turn. Here we go. Hi. Hi! Oh my god, it's so cute! Every time I there's more! The yes, there's more Keith Haring decals! Yes! You're right? Excellent work. Thank you. Are you on TaskRabbit as well? No. no? <laughs> you have the Alani gummies? Dang, you're so with the trends! Really? Yeah! It's so cute. I like your hair. I did it last night. It kind of tones some of it and then oh. some of it it actually grabs. I like it. It's very complimentary. Thanks. Hollywood is, it's a little bit of like a contentious area because it's like there's a lot of pressure for Hollywood to be good because it's like Hollywood, Star of Fame, Chinese Man Theater. It's kind of like a tourist trap. Yeah. So I was like trying to find something cool to do in yeah. Hollywood. And so I found this place called, have you been to Japan House? No, What's no. That? It's like this like gallery yeah. of like Japanese art, but then there's also a gift shop with it's kind of like a Muji, but like more elevated, Whoa. like more considered. Is it new? I have no idea. I found it on Google Maps. Yeah. It's kind of a look, Anna. Wow. And then how long do I have to do this for? Forty-five. Forty-five. If there was a heaven, this would be one of the dimensions. It's just the hair washing station level. Wow, so satisfying. <laughs> I'll just get the jasmine green tea. <gasps> oh, oh my god! Hidden for you. The final check, really? Yeah. Wait, seriously? Yeah. Little baby time. Yeah. <laughs> this is my happy spot. Mm Okay, I just wanted to show you guys a proper after. This is like right outside the salon. And now we're gonna head out to Hollywood. <laughs> I guess we're already in Hollywood, but I'm gonna take you guys to apparently a tourist trap, but I've never actually been there. So we're gonna go there together. I don't know, it's pretty scenic here, guys. And that's where the Hollywood sign is. I do need to get a couple of bits at Sephora though. The brow pencil I use right now is a little bit too dark for my actual hair. Maybe this caramel one looks better. Not bad. I haven't been in a Johnny Rocket since I've worked here. This is one of my part-time jobs I've had. Just the smell of it is bringing so many memories back. It's like the smell of just like grease and cleaning supplies, burgers. I would always get the, the patty melt, but unfortunately that's not on the menu anymore. <laughs> so since they don't have the patty melt, I went for the burger instead. My burger has arrived. Gosh, I really don't remember it looking like this. I don't know, have they changed the burger? I don't know. Mmm. Ketchup. It's like smash burger bread, where it's like that soft, pillowy Hawaiian style bread. Mmm. I feel like working in food and hospitality really shaped the way I developed. I was able to learn 
what Western manners were actually like. Because sure, you go to school and you get integrated that way. But when your job is to be polite, attentive, and service other people, you have to adopt really fast or else you're just not going to get the tips that you want. And my immigrant parents weren't the ones that were going to teach me this. Like they were still, they were in survival mode. When I first started out serving, I was pretty bad. I got my first one cent tip when I was 15. But the thing is, I think I did something pretty nasty. So I guess I had a cold that day and I went up to the woman and I was like, what can I get for you? That really disturbed her. And so she left a penny and wrote a note being like, next time you need to wipe your nose, use a tissue. And I was like, I mean, it was good feedback. I did get progressively better. I learned to not attach my, my self-worth on the tips that I was getting. Could have given a table rock and service, but let's say they just didn't have the extra cash to give you. We are out in the middle of Melrose Avenue because I'm about to meet twice. I know, what, what? I know, what is my life? We're gonna film a little Instagram reel. Their album drops today with youth. I listened to it on the drive here. Six snappy songs, 17 minutes. You can blast through it. Really excited to meet the girls and I'm super excited to be eating a bunch of snacks with them. I brought like six of my favorite chips, so we'll see which chips rise to the top. I'm rolling deep tonight, guys. We've got Ashley, my manager. Drew. <laughs> Evie. She just helps me with everything, guys. Nancy. Hello. Guys, what a surreal night. Wild. Before I passed out, I wanted to quickly remind you to click the description box and visit my link, betterhelp.com slash Jen. When you click that link, it helps support my channel and it also gets you 10% off your first month using BetterHelp. There are over 4 million people who have used BetterHelp to have just like a deeper, more connected relationship with themselves. So if you guys are interested, click the link. Uh, but yeah, that is all for this vlog. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Good night.